Welcome to Finley City Schools Kindergarten Readiness Presentation. My name is Kyle Mansfield and I'm a kindergarten teacher at Finley City Schools. In this presentation, we will be going over how to register your child, how to sign up for screening, ideas to help your child be ready for kindergarten, and what we will learn in kindergarten. When this presentation is over, you will have the opportunity to ask any questions by submitting them through a Google form. We will talk more about that at the end of the presentation. Finley City Schools will operate with three K-2 buildings and three 3-5 through five buildings for the 2021-2022 school year. The three K-2 buildings are Jefferson Primary, Northview Primary, and Whittier Primary. Here you will find the address and contact information for each of these buildings. The provided link at the bottom will allow you to type in your address to find which school your child will be attending. This link will also be available as in the description. Finley City Schools is currently going through a building reduction. At this time, the link should reflect which building your child will be in next year with the building reduction. Let's take a look at the link and see what it looks like and how to use it. When you click on the link, it will take you to this website. Uh, right here, you can type in your address and the zip code, and then you can change this if you want to. I would just leave it say all grades in schools. Obviously, if you have other kids, it will help you with that as well. You can look at, it'll tell you all of them, the stops for a bus if you ride the bus, if your child will be eligible to ride the bus and which school. Um, as you can see, I, so what I did is I typed in the address for Whittier Elementary just as a, an example address. And it tells me that if, if I lived at Whittier Elementary, I would go to Donnell Middle School, obviously Finley High School, and then Whittier Elementary. And then it tells you like the times, if you ride the bus, bus number five, for example, and it depart, when it departs and when it arrives. So this is a good website. If you're unsure of exactly what school you'll be attending next year, you can use this website and it will help you out. Registration for the 2021-2022 school year will begin on March 1st, 2021. You will need to register your child online by following this provided link. The link will also be available as a clickable link in the description. Screening will be completed in the spring. It is very important that you have registered and signed up for screening as soon as possible. Be sure to sign up for screening first and then complete the registration process. If your child attends Washington Preschool, they will be screened at Washington. However, you do still need to register your child for kindergarten. This link at the bottom is how you will sign up for screening. Again, this will be available as a clickable link in the description. So let's go ahead and take a look at those two links. First, let's take a look at the um, Finley City Schools um, Final Forms link. If you already have an account with Final Forms, you will just hit the login right here and sign in to, to do all the, to fill out the necessary forms. If you don't have an account, you'll hit new account and sign up that way. The other, uh, the other link that's provided is the one at the bottom that I mentioned that will, you will use to uh, sign up for screening and to re for screening registration. Um, as you can see, I, I obviously typed in fake information for this just so I could show you what it is. You will put your child's first name, last name, their date of birth, their gender, and then it says ask for which building they'll be attending. You can hit uh, Jefferson, Northview, or Whittier, or if you're not sure, you can just hit uncertain and then hit next and it will bring you to this screen where you'll type in your information. Again, I just put in fake information here. You'll need your name, your email, your phone number, and your address. And then it will also ask if your child attended preschool last year and which preschool they did attend if they attended. Lastly, you can do what language is spoken in your home. If it's English, you just hit that and that's it. If it's in a different language, you'll hit this and then type in the language there. And then you hit next. On this screen, it's just asking you what time you prefer for screening. Um, once you fill that out, we'll collect all the information and send out information regarding what date and time your child's screen will be. We'll talk about that um, in a little bit later date as well. Hi, my name is Ross Mansfield. I am also a kindergarten teacher with Finley City Schools. This slide focuses on the necessary documentation in order to enroll your child in kindergarten. In order to complete the registration process, all of this information must be provided to Finley City Schools Welcome Center. Please call 419-425-8275 to schedule an appointment. To complete your child's registration, we will need proof of residency by providing one of the following lease or rental agreement, real estate tax bill, or more mortgage statement, bank statement, a utility bill, but it cannot be a cell phone, medical, or credit card bill, or a notarized affidavit if you're residing with someone else and none of the above documents are in the guardian's name. Please keep in mind that your proof of residency must be current and it must have the parent or guardian's name on it. Additionally, 
we will need your child's birth certificate. It must be an original attested copy, your child's immunization record, your driver's license or other parent or guardian photo ID, and when applicable, child custody papers, divorce decree, or guardianship documents if the child is placed with you by the courts. The immunization requirements for your child to begin kindergarten are listed here. Please complete your child's immunization before school begins in the fall. This ensures that all necessary documentation and requirements are met before school starts. We do, need, we do need a copy of the immunization record when you turn in your paperwork. Screening will take place at Millstream Cafe. You will be assigned a date and time for a screening and it will last approximately 15 minutes. Be sure to bring your child. Skills that will be checked during screening include recognizing their name, stating their age, identifying colors and shapes, rhyming, counting, identifying letters, writing their first name, cutting on a line, and answering basic questions. Hi, my name is Kylie Givens. I am another kindergarten teacher at Finley City Schools. You might be asking yourself, is my child ready for kindergarten? If you're not sure, this graphic provides several kindergarten readiness skills. These are skills that would be beneficial for your child to know and be able to do prior to starting kindergarten. Self-help skills include using the bathroom independently, zipping their coat, button or snap their pants, and recognize, recognizing their first name. Fine motor skills include holding a pencil with an appropriate grip, writing their first name, using scissors to cut on a line, tracing lines and shapes, and coloring and drawing a picture. Social skills that your child will want to be able to do prior to school include following two-step directions, sit and listen to a 10-minute story, play a game and accept losing, take turns while playing, practice regulating their emotions, and complete tasks without adult assistance. Lastly, academic skills include counting to at least 20, recognize numbers 0 to 10, sing and say the ABCs, identify their letter names, especially the letters in their name, and following directions. These are not required skills, but they are skills that will greatly benefit your child in ensuring they are prepared and ready for kindergarten. Continuing with readiness skills, we will talk more about specific skills to practice before kindergarten starts. Have your child begin to write their name with the first letter being uppercase and the rest lowercase. You may need to dot out their name for them and have them trace it in the beginning. Practice counting with your child at least to 20 and begin talking about the following shapes circle, rectangle, triangle, square, and hexagon. Identifying colors and the letters in their name as well. Lastly, play board, play board games and card games with your child in order for them to practice taking turns and even losing. Our last slide of kindergarten readiness includes reading to your child, cutting and gluing. This can be done by making crafts together, buttoning and zipping, and lastly, coloring. We want them to begin to color in the lines using colors that make sense and to fill in the white space. Again, all of these skills are suggestions and ideas to do with your child to help them be prepared for the start of their kindergarten school year. Hi, my name is Christy Teal. I am also a kindergarten teacher at Finley City Schools. Now we want to transition to what your child will be learning in kindergarten. This is not a comprehensive list of what they will learn, but rather a general overview. In kindergarten, we learn letters and sounds, cite words, identify and produce rhyming words, and we learn to count on from a given number, as well as counting to 100. Additionally, we will work on sorting, number identification, 2D and 3D shapes, and basic addition and subtraction. In kindergarten, we spend a lot of time with books. We do daily read alouds and guided reading groups to help students learn to read and be successful. The book on the left is an example of a predictable beginning reader, usually one line of the text and repetitive other than one word. The book on the right is an example of a text that demonstrates the end of the year expectation. These books are usually between two to five lines of text and use a combination of high frequency words, sometimes called sight words, and decodable words. These are words that students will need to sound out and use learned reading strategies to solve. Additionally, we work on comparing stories, answering questions about the text, and recalling characters, setting, and main idea. 
Reading is an important part of kindergarten and we spend a lot of time working on developing these skills. All of the buildings in Finley City Schools are Leader in Me schools. Leader in Me is a school-wide model that empowers students to develop leadership skills as well as life skills. There are seven habits that go along with Leader in Me. The habits are habit one, be proactive. Habit two, begin with the end in mind. Habit three, put first things first. Habit four, think win-win. Habit five, seek first to understand, then to be understood. Habit six is synergize. And habit seven is sharpen the saw. Your child will learn all about the seven habits as they enter kindergarten. Here is a short video highlighting some of the exciting opportunities your child will have as they become a Trojan. Make new and awesome friends. You wish school year never ends. We want you to be a Trojan. We want you to be a Trojan. We want you to be a Trojan. We want you to be Trojan true. Discover new and awesome things. You get to spread your learning wings. We have our teachers by our side. Finley City Schools has Trojan pride. We want you to be a Trojan. We want you to be a Trojan. We want you to be a Trojan. We want you to be Trojan true. We understand that you may still have some questions or concerns regarding kindergarten and the registration process. If you have any questions, please use this link to fill out a Google form. This link will also be available as a clickable link in the description. Let's go ahead and click on this link to check out the form. So when you click on the link, it will bring you up to this form right here. As you can see, it says incoming kindergarten parent questions. If you have any questions or concerns, go ahead and use this box right here. Um, if you have more than one question or more than one thing to say, just go ahead and type that all in here and then you just hit submit. And once you hit submit, that will make sure that we have time to, uh, it will send it to us and then we can organize those. So uh, please be sure to submit any questions by March 12th, 2021, so that we have time to organize and prepare responses. There will be an upcoming Trojan talk where we will answer and discuss your questions. Thank you for watching this presentation. Please reach out if you have any questions or concerns and to utilize the provided form for questions. We look forward to meeting your family and working with you to provide the best kindergarten experience for your child.